Hey guys, um, yeah, 100. I know that's a lot of questions, but anyway, I thought of um, updating my get to know me questions. Years go by, life change. Not really. <laughs> um, so I've got my laptop with me today to read the questions out. Let's go. I'm just, I'm not gonna say question number one, number two, just to save time. Okay. All right, are you, are you a morning or a night person? I'm definitely a um, morning person. I find it really hard to stay up at night unless I've had plenty of sleep the day before. So yeah. Um, are you afraid of the dark? Sometimes, I guess. Depends if I watch a scary movie. Um, now that I'm pregnant, I'll probably get a bit more scared um, watching scary movie. I wouldn't watch it unless I've got someone with me. So yeah. Uh, are you an extrovert or introvert? I think I'm both because I go through a season where I just want to be an outdoorsy person. Then I feel like I've exposed myself too much. So then I end up spending time alone. Could be probably like for a week or so. And then once I'm recharged, out again. Every now and then I think everybody needs both anyways. Are you double jointed? I doubt it. <laughs> I doubt that I'm double jointed. Are you left or right handed? Right handed. I'm not saying that left handed isn't good. Are you more of a tidy per tidy person or a messy one? I think it depends. Mostly, I'll probably say I'm 80% tidy per of, a, of a tidy person. I can't even speak. Um, I can be messy if I'm busy, but then I'll look around and be like, oh gosh, it's a mess and then clean it up pretty quick. So yeah. Are you on time or always late? Depends on the event. If it's an African thing, I'm not gonna be on time. <laughs> if it's an appointment, obviously I'm on time. If it's to do with work, I'm on time. If it's really, really important, I'm early. So yeah. All right. Are you ticklish? Yes but to some degree, not like very ticklish. Not as soon as a person comes and try and tickle me, I'm like, freaking out like it has to be a, like a sensitive area can you curl your tongue obviously <laughs> um can you ice skate no i'm not good at that but i can try like i'm not a professional i can try and do a few things but other than that i'm not i'm not really a good ice skater can you wiggle your ears? Yes, I can, but I've got this on. I can't really try. I can probably, I don't know if I can try. I don't know if you can see. <laughs> oh boy, um, coffee or tea? Definitely tea. I used to drink coffee, but now that I'm pregnant, I don't see myself drinking much caffeine. Just try and keep it limited. All right, cookies, cake, or donuts. Not a sweet tooth person. I can have cakes sometimes, depends on what kind of cake, but usually I'm more of a savory person. Do you ever participate in a talent show? Not really. <laughs> Do you go to prom? Did you go to prom? Mm, no, I just went to U12. I don't know if it's the same in Australia, we call it U12 or U10 formal. Maybe, I'm not sure if it's the same thing or not. Did you like school? In the beginning when I first came to Australia, I did. After that, I was like, somebody help me. <laughs> Do you believe in ghosts? Mm, I would say yes. Do you bite your nails? No, that's a habit that I don't like. <laughs> I see people doing it, I'm just like, don't. Do you consider yourself a good cook? To some degree, I wouldn't say I'm the best, but I can cook something. I can cook a few dishes. Do you enjoy dancing? Yes, definitely. Yes. Do you enjoy DIYs or crafts? Yes, I do. Because um, of my work, I work with kids. So pretty much we do craft almost every day. So that's something that I really enjoy. It's calming. Do you forgive easily? <laughs> That depends on the person and what they did to me. Like if you kills my family, I'm not gonna forgive you easily. If you break my heart, I'm not going to forgive you easily. 
if you did something and it's upsetting me yeah, like casual things you took money or I'll get over things like that or you took my stuff without asking yeah I'll forgive you but I'll be like don't do it again please <laughs> do you have nickname yes it's Namoyo okay leave it like that <laughs> do you have any allergies zero allergies so that's something that I'm very thankful for piercings or tattoos um no yes for my ears but nowhere else so yeah that's about it do you have children expecting so i will be having one um do you have pets i used to not anymore but i really want a cat my dream is to have one of those hairless cats. I can't remember the name. I keep forgetting the name of them. I love those cats. I don't know why. Do you have siblings? Plenty. Let me just tell you, plenty. So if I'm number eight, there's plenty. Um, do you prefer dogs or cats? Cats. When I became pregnant, when I fell pregnant, I can't stand the smell of dogs. I really can't. It makes me gag it makes me sick do you prefer Mac or PC I don't mind I'm not a big fan of technology but I do have a you know Mac because of video editing and you know it has a lot of good things that come with it other than that if I wasn't video editing just doing a regular thing I'll just have a normal PC do you prefer the beach or the mountains? Both. I like anything outdoors, nature. I actually like, yeah, outdoors. Do you prefer bath or showers? Again, both. It's one of those things where sometimes you feel like a bath, sometimes you feel like showers. Depends. You can't really have a bath if you're in a hurry. You want to enjoy yourself. You want to enjoy, um, you know, what you do. Not like that. <laughs> Sorry. That came off wrong. <laughs> Oh boy, um, do you sing in the shower sometimes? If my favorite music is playing, but usually I hum sometimes, but not too much. Oh, do you smoke? No, no, no. Health is wealth. Remember, do you speak any different languages? Yes, I speak Sudanese. I speak, which is Sudanese. We do have tribal languages and then we do have a local Sudanese Arabic language. Then English. So yeah, I do. Um, do you still have your wisdom tooth? I don't think so. Do you still watch cartoons? Mm, anime? But I don't really know. I used to like watching Avatar, but not anymore. I don't really watch much cartoons nowadays. Nowadays, now that I'm pregnant and preparing for this child. Um, do you have... Okay, sorry. Do you or have you played any sports? Yes, I played soccer. I played basketball and I did swimming. Um, yeah, I did all that for fun in, in a team. Um, does your name have a special meaning? Um, Because my dad's sister was named after me. So if referring to Namayo, English name is just like Julia, Jolia basic um have you ever been hypnotized no and i'm not sure if i would want that <laughs> oh gosh um have you ever been on a diet yes well we are we are all on diet usually whether if it's a healthy or unhealthy diet i was vegan for three years um have you ever been to a concert an african concert but not not a famous person just like her and also local con concerts um have you ever gone camping yes when i was in high school and yeah i get scared sleeping outside have you ever skipped class yes i wagged school sorry class not school when i was in high school when i was in year nine because i didn't like the teacher and I was like, it will be nice to just do my own thing. I didn't really get in trouble, which is good. Have you ever won something? Yeah. Awards, medals. Yeah. Lots of things. Yes. 
have you had braces? No. It's like, um, how are you feeling right now? Well, I am feeling great. I'm feeling bright. That's why I wore yellow today. Um, yeah, feel great. <laughs> how tall are you? I am 172. But then when I went and checked when I was pregnant, I did my weight, height, whatnot. Apparently I'm 171. So disappointed kind of if money if money were not object um what would you get for your next birthday i would like a vacation if you could live anywhere in the world where would it be an island what city were you born in i was born in sudan in khartoum i don't know if you know where that is what did you what did you last eat well dates And beans. <laughs> so yeah, I had beans not long ago. Now I'm having dates because I'm craving sugar. Um, what did I want to be when I was younger? I wanted to become a nun. I don't know why. <laughs> don't ask. A nun sounded like a good thing. Because they could teach. They could travel the world. They could do a lot of stuff back in my... um hometown in Sudan I went to a really private school so we were taught by nuns what do you do on a typical Friday night see I don't just specifically do one thing all the time I pretty much plan or sometimes if I, f I do whatever I feel like if I feel like going somewhere pack up and go if I feel like staying in I stay in so I don't really have a specific thing that I do I'm always doing something new unless if I'm lethargic from my pregnancy then I just stay at home food that you refuse to eat I don't really have oh wait bacon <laughs> I don't really have oh yeah bacon and fatty foods what is um one item on your bucket list travel to Fiji that's one of them um what is one item you can't live without we all can't live without food and water, so I'm not sure about that question. What is your f sorry? What is your shoe size? I'm size eight in women. What movie have you watched um, repeatedly? Oh yes, I am a legend. I Robot and that The Matrix matrix if that's how you say it <laughs> um all those sci-fi movies that i if i enjoy a movie i can always revisit what type of phone do you have apple android i've got an android oh gosh miss goals i've got an android so i used to have an apple got stolen never bothered to buy another one and it was really new i had it like for christmas the end of last year um, what would what would you be doing right now? What should you be doing right now? Um, living my life, <laughs> do what I like, I guess. Um, what wh um, what's one goal you would like to accomplish this year? Okay, to do the things that I always wanted to do. So anything that I really wanted to do, just go for it that's something that I want to accomplish this year be free be just live life the way I want to not that I haven't it's just be more yes go with it you know um and yeah that's what I want to do accomplish this year and YouTube is one of them too because I stopped for like almost a year and I was like oh maybe I should come back and now I'm just like just anything comes any thought that comes to my head and I want to talk about I'll just make a video it might help someone else. You never know. Um, what's one of your pet peeves? I'm not sure what that means. But I don't really have a pet at the moment. What's the last song you've listened to? <laughs> I was actually listening to music not long ago. I was listening to Khalid. He um, I'm not a big fan on buying really expensive clothes. But... I can buy jewelry like based on good crystals and stuff 
um, you're probably like off a um, maybe off Myers, maybe dresses and things like that. Not not too much of a materialistic person. Um, what's the thing you can't leave the house without? My clothes, my keys, um, bottle of water. Um, that's it really. Eyebrows done, not joking. I can leave the house without any makeup, so it's not really. I get a lot of compliments on my lips, I think, and smile and eyes, so I'm not sure. I like everything. I don't really go, this part's not good. I mean, what you're going to do? Like, you just got to love who you are. I'm not the kind of person to go, oh, I wish I could change my eyebrow. Like, not eyebrow, sorry, my hands or, nah, I just love everything about it. Um, what's your Chinese sign? I think I'm a goat. Yeah. I think I'm a goat or pig, I'm not sure. What's your current obsession? Don't have any obsession really. Oh wait, food has always been my obsession. Not obsession, just things, just love food. <laughs> so it is an obsession. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, what's your dream car? Don't have one. Just any car, any fresh new engine I'll drive. What's your favorite animal? Cats. What's your favorite book? Don't really have a favorite book. I don't read too much, but I, only if it's to do with um, useful information, obviously. But then I wouldn't call them favorite. It's just information, you know. What's your favorite color? I love orange. I love purple. And I think I'm starting to dig um, yellow. Yellow is... Ten, it's, it's, looking good on my skin so yeah I like yellow now as well what's your favorite dessert I think date pudding as you can see I love dates so mm. date pudding definitely favorite drink mm. kombucha but I can't have it all the time so your favorite food all food except the ones that I don't feel like eating like bacon and whatnot mostly plant-based ones I also like um, my favorite foreign food I don't really have a foreign food maybe noodles maybe what's your favorite hobby I think I just like everything that makes me feel happy. So music, sport or exercise. Uh, your favorite restaurant? All restaurants are my favorite. Clean ones. <laughs> favorite sandwich? Oh yes, everything. I like everything, just except the food that I mentioned earlier that I don't eat. Um, favorite um, season? I like... Um, Spring, summer, and winter. A little bit of winter, not when it gets really cold. Just at the beginning of winter. Then it gets too cold and I'm like, mm, -mm. Favorite series? Oh, yes. The Walking Dead. Prison Break. Um, Walking Dead, Prison Break. What else do I like? Um, Game of Thrones, I used to watch all those, but yeah, I'm starting to watch the Vikings, I don't know if it's good or not, so, I used to watch Vampire Diaries, I used to watch all these interesting, um, series, your favorite snack, uh, fruit, your favorite sport to watch, I don't really watch sport, um, what's your favorite thing to have for breakfast? Yeah, just any, whatever I feel like I just have. If it's porridge, if it's um, medida, which is a Sudanese food that we make. If it's cup of tea, I think I also like coffee, but not too much. Um, what's your full name? I already mentioned that earlier, did I? No, just Jolly Atombeck. Your longest relationship 
so far well I'm not in any relationship I'm in a relationship with myself um, my lucky number is four your star sign okay my star sign as you all can tell from the color I'm a Leo um, when's your birthday is in August which city did you grow up in I grew up in Sudan and then my family moved to Egypt and then we came to Australia so yeah which city do you live in now I live in Australia in New South Wales what do you miss right now I miss being able to run 5k because I'm pregnant now I can't do that <laughs> around the lake um, what is your celebrity crush Ooh. oh boy I used to love Jon Snow then he went to the prison break guy I don't love him but I thought he was a cool person because he could like do all those things um, guys so I think I'm beautiful Idris Alba yes he's gorgeous he's good he's too old for me I know <laughs> um, I wouldn't say crush I just think they're good-looking men young men as well and older men doesn't matter they're just men um, I think also Quincy has a pretty boy look as well um, and there's a lot of beautiful guys out there who's your favorite fictional character I don't really have any yeah that was a lot of questions I hope you enjoyed this get to know um, get to know me questions hundred of them and yeah see you guys